Let's do it. Fun video, bro. I fucking I love these videos, man. Request more shit like this. More shit where I could do commentary and shit, man. I love this shit. W recommendation. The Masked Man. Featuring Degenerosity. Whatever the fuck that means. In this video, I'm going to be attempting to trigger every single anime and manga fandom that I- If he triggers me, I'm gonna pull the trigger. I possibly can. I've seen a video on this regarding NBA superstars and I thought it was quite enjoyable. However, I do want to give this slight disclaimer now that even I don't believe some of the crap I'm gonna say in this video, but if it offends you, then it means I did my job. As Nothing could offend me. Nothing. I am, am made of thick skin. Thick fucking skin, man. Look at me. Nothing offends me. I'm Chad. I'm Chad's Chad. I'm, I'm Dr. Chad. Actually really pissed myself off having to re-listen to this for the editing. Let's start off with the members of the big three. Naruto. Alright, whatever you say about this is not going to offend me. Naruto has to be one of the most confusing series to talk about. Whilst although it is extreme... This is what Mount Rushmore was built after. This is what inspired Mount Rushmore right here. I couldn't believe it when I read that, man. I was like, that's how they got the idea? Incredible, man. Incredible. Anime, it's just... It's insane, it's impact on the world. It's really beautiful in its thematics and it has some great characters. It equally has as many plot holes and characters who are absolute trash. Oh. Guys, how do you feel about this take? Sakura, the poster child for useless characters, is actually far from the most useless character in the series. Heck, Shit. apparently the author of the series didn't even come up with the best stuff. It was the editor who came up with Sasuke's character and the majority take, of the aspects be important to the series. I'm seeing a lot of Ws. Ask yourself the I have no opinion. If your sequel series is Boruto, was your series ever that good to begin with? I said that nothing offends me, but that's going too far. Why would you say that? Why would he say that? What, what? You kind of have to ask yourself the question. If your sequel series is Boruto, was your series ever that good to begin? I'm buying a gun. I'm doxing him. With One Piece. I'm buying a gun, bro. That's it. Th that, that was disrespectful. That was disrespectful. That hurt my feelings. I, I can't. How hard they try to make it seem different. One Piece isn't really all that great. Okay, this, I'm about to detach my fucking arm and use it as a weapon, man. You, what, what, what's going on here? Listen, it doesn't matter to me how long your series has been going on for. For example, I'd rather have three to five years of Michael Jordan and LeBron versus 20 years of Iman Shumpert. And that I don't want any of those years. Fuck basketball. That's exactly what One Piece is. It puts up big numbers, but in reality, it's a series that seems to pretty much why do, do nothing. Why do people recommend this It has some good world building, stuff. but outside of why that, do you do the this? characters are boring and the character designs are horrendous. Let's be honest. The All right, I'm done being offended. Thick skin. Thick skin. Thick skin, guys. Come on, come on. Put your thick skin on. Majority of the fandom surrounding Anna Tube and Anna Twitter would be dead if it wasn't for One Piece. We're good, we're good, we're good. You guys we're good, are so busy good. looking at every panel, constantly deep throwing Oda and One Piece every chance you get. We're good! Oh, Goda, oh, Goat Piece. You guys seem incapable of going 10 seconds without reminding everyone how One Piece is better than Naruto and it is! combined. Uh, I said I won't, I said I won't, I won't, I said I won't get offended. I said, I said I have thick skin. Despite having easily the worst protagonist out of the big three, Bleach. I'm sorry, Bleach fans. I don't know how many times you need to be reminded of this, but you are easily the worst series out of the big three. I haven't even watched it yet, and I know that's wrong. I know that's wrong. I know that's wrong, guys. Is that the worst? Is that the, 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 the is that the... Guys, how about I go up to this YouTuber and I suffocate him with this? I'll suffocate him with what he thinks is, is, is mid. I'll fucking suffocate him with him. Free. Heck, you couldn't even keep your anime running properly, and One Piece somehow has managed to do so. Also, the background of Bleach has so much white in it, it's the KKK's favorite manga. Ichigo's a boring protagonist, and the only reason the majority- It's the KKK's favorite manga? Is that true? Is that why y'all like it? Y'all are part of them, aren't you? He's right? I don't give a fuck, bro. I'm still watching it. KKK or not, man, the music's dope. I'm watching it. Pretty of you like Bleach is. I don't care if they produce the show because of the cool character designs and the sexy women. The fights would actually be pretty compelling if they didn't spend the whole time explaining to their opponent how to beat him. Oh, and the typical. Uh, this has to be comedy. He has to be joking. He has to be joking. Bleach falls off after right? Soul Society. Right, right. Like, like this is like I irony, right, or some bullshit. Like th this is a fucking. This is a joke, right? Big three, Berserk. Where is he going with this? 
Berserk is easily one of the most critically acclaimed manga of all time, and despite it being an absolute masterpiece, it could really use without the rape. I mean, come on, with all of the creativity in the world, the author couldn't think of somehow writing this series and portraying struggles without having a woman naked every five seconds? The fights are- I have an opinion on that. You ready? It's a fucking story. It's a story, okay? They could write about what they want. When Mir originally transitioned from- It's live, it's live, it happens. Especially during the Berserk era in real life. Cool to digital, it actually looked funky as hell. Also, Guts has to be- I don't like killing. I don't like death. I don't like sex. I think he's being- he's joking around. He's just being edgy. He's just- it's, it's his fucking character, man. He's doing it purposely. Like, it's- when did this come out? April 1st, it had to be. To be one of the most uninspired names for a protagonist ever. So what do you plan on naming your protagonist? Uh, actually, I don't know. Well Guys, what name do you like better? Guts? Or Boruto? No, no, Guts or Naruto. What name is better? I, I, I like Guts better than Gon. I fucking love that name. I love that name. I, know, I love Guts. I, I love that fucking name, man. Guts. Well, where does he come from? Well, he was born from his mother's guts and Vagabond. Vagabond, again, another very beautiful manga, especially in its illustration. I actually have it. I have Vagabond. I thought it was Vagabond. It's Vagabond. But if I have to hear another Vagabond fan coming over the fact that Musashi Miyamoto said poo poo pee pee fart, I'm going to absolutely lose it. And despite whatever criticisms I had to say about One Piece, at least it could continue its release consistently. Seriously, How this feel series about was this so take? not worth it that the author decided to drop it to create a whole nother new series. I think I rest my case. Good night, pun pun. Good night, pun pun. I thought it was poon poon. Good night, pun. This man is playing with fire. <laughs> I should make a video like this. I don't think I'd be able to do it. I, even as a joke, there's some things I can't say. Like Attack on Titan suck. I, it, uh, ugh, I almost fucking threw up saying Pun that. is nothing but pure depression. I don't know. Spy Family is the greatest. See, see I can't. Anyone would ever read can't. this manga and or even put themselves through it. It's kind of like the whole thing with Neon Genesis Evangelion. People who like these series are just people who don't have good mental health and want to make it seem quirky by talking about how much they like these series. Hunter x Hunter, or Hunter x Hunter, I really don't care. Hunter x Hunter fans will constantly remind you how it's the greatest shonen of all time. It's pretty fucking good. I would know that because I've watched it several times. Hate to break it to you, but it's no better than Naruto Bleach or One Piece. So I see some people triggered in the chat. Seriously, I don't understand how a series that can't understand the basic use of dialogue and not overusing it can be better. Hon I love that. I love dialogue. You see, there's some shows I can watch and just look at chat and look around the room and I haven't missed anything. Hunter Hunter, you gotta read every fucking sentence. Every sentence means something. It's like people get mad that like you you, you missed that. And I I look away for one second, fucking paragraph comes on the screen and it describes like 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 everything. The the ways of the universe. You know what I mean? I love this shit. I love dialogue. What but not enough pew pew pew. Yeah pew pew pew. There's not enough of that. Too many words? What are you afraid of fucking vocabulary? You're afraid of words? I still miss everything, that's true. Honestly, let's look at- Even when I'm reading it, I miss it. Hunter Hunter. It has an okay protagonist with a better deuteragonist. There he is. There's our mascot for the channel. Killua. Nah. Uh, who who y'all like better, Gon or Killua? With a solid antagonist to cast. Yeah, there wow, is. super- Wait, are we just getting fucking spoiler territory? We're different. Also, Chimera Antark is extremely boring in its first- Get the fuck out, why? What? Boring? You want boring? Go to the previous arc, fucking Greed Island, man. What? Get the fuck out of here. First half. And despite Hunter Hunter fans posting the same five panels on Twitter, I'm. St I don't want to know. I don't want to see the panels. I don't want to see. I don't want to see the panels. I, I'm skipping. Oh, right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. What is he gonna say? Demon Slayer is the best anime. That would be a fucking hot take. Have possibly the worst sense of humor ever, and I hope your series gets axed immediately. Demon Slayer. Ninja said this was the greatest anime of all time. Did Ninja say that? Guys, did Ninja actually... Did Ninja's, Ninja's the reason behind Demon Slayer's success is what you're telling me. And Ninja and Tim the Tatman know as much about anime and manga as I do about Polish politics. In other words, nothing. I hope to never be a big streamer like that, man. I'm like anti-big streamer. 
I don't I don't watch big streamers. They're fucking boring to me. Like I like the size I am right now. I don't want to be that big. I don't want to be like 80,000 viewers. I, I, I'm fine where the fuck I am right now, man. Because when you have that many viewers, you have to compromise. You have to be different. You, you, you have to say what you don't want to say. You, you got to feed into the fucking system, man. I never want to be that big. I want to be where I am. Thing. People who are fans of Demon Slayer know better than people who are fans of Drake. People who just enjoy the typical mainstream stuff that lacks as much creativity as possible, yet try to gas it up to be some deep philosophical thing. Demon Slayer will be one of the poster boys of Shonen to come only because of its anime. Demon Slayer is fucking huge, man. And I, I think y'all know my opinion on it. It's good. I enjoy it. It's definitely not even my top 10, you know what I mean? I enjoy it. I love watching it. But I watch better stuff. You know, One Piece better. I, I enjoy Black Clover more. Attack on Titan, One Punch Man, JJK, ReZero. What else have I watched? Cowboy Bebop, Death Note. Yeah, like I put all of these ahead. Vin, how the fuck do I remember Vinland Saga? <laughs> yeah, bro, that's at the fucking peak. Look, look, I'm at nine. I'm at nine. What else have I watched? Mob Psycho. Hunter Hunter. <laughs> yeah, man. Demon Slayer is like behind. I think Demon Slayer is in last place. JoJo. Uh, I don't know. I, I think I have to watch more JoJo to say. Full Metal. Boruto's dad. Exactly. I dropped like most of them, man. Spy Family. No, no, no. I wouldn't say it's that bad. But I still like I still like it. I still, I still like Demon Slayer. I still enjoy it. But all of those are ahead. Honestly. Considering the fact that nobody really knew about the manga before the anime even came out. You have a decent protagonist with two of the main side characters being extremely underused and one of the most disappointing final antagonists ever. You have <laughs> I'm waiting to see Muzan do something. You have to have literally nothing I else like going him. on in your life I like you spend all day I like posting him. and talking about Demon Slayer. In fact, that applies to almost anybody who spends all day only posting about one anime on their Twitter account. For you people, I'll be leaving a link to a McDonald's application form down in the description below. Shit. Monogatari. Pedophile. My Hero Academia has to be one of the most lame series <laughs> Bro, My Hero fans? Uh, oh my god, I don't know who... I don't know who... It seems crazier. My Hero fans or Boruto fans, but both came from my neck once. Ever, and the only reason its fan base works is because most of the people who were into it have never read a decent comic book in their life. I guarantee you, almost every single major plotline and interesting character is something we've already seen from a comic book before. The MHA fandom is the exact embodiment of a place versus a place Japan. Also, Deku's an extremely uninteresting and boring protagonist. Y'all fuck with My Hero. percent of his own series. My Hero Academics. Can't seem to introduce a really interesting character without them being taken out just in the next chapter. After. MHA fans are the equivalent of Oh shit M MHA fans are, are the equivalent to fucking BTS fans K-pop stands of Anna Twitter And in fact they're Oh god that's Jin I know that from BTS are Allergic to both sunlight and gr I think. grass Also can you please go 5 seconds without having to remind everyone How your series is better than Black Clover Honestly Guys my hero or Black Clover we're gonna find out right now. That's not much of an accomplishment in the first place. Jujutsu Kaisen. Jujutsu. What, like, what could you possibly say? If he gets to attack on Titan, I'm closing the video. Yo, yo, do a poll. Do a poll. Do a poll right now. I need to know. Black Clover or My Hero? It's up there. It's up there. Let's see what's winning. Black Clover's fucking destroying it. Oh my god. Jujutsu Kaisen or Shit. JJK is another series that is hyped up more than it actually is. I'm sorry JJK fans, but I'm not going to give you brownie points all because the women in your series do more than the bare minimum. It's not better than Bleach. The only reason why anyone would think that is because of JJK or Bleach. Recency bias and good animation. Black Clover. Black Clover. I'm on episode like 108 of Black Clover. So I think I could, I, I could contribute an opinion on this it was an absolute disgrace to manga as <laughs> to how when god's green holy earth was the author such a big fan of berserk and constantly references it in the manga while having one of the most boring protagonists deuteragonist i can't stand you know i can't I, I i just don't like him i don't like you know i don't he doesn't interest me he's boring 
I, I don't care if it's an L take. I, I'm not a you know fan, bro. Black Clover is one of those animes with so many fucking characters. So many to choose from. And I don't like you know, but I like so many others. Mary Leona, Yami, I like um Luck, uh, Vanessa, Gordon, um Marie. No, I don't like Marie. What, what the fuck I sound like saying that, man? What the fuck I sound like that? I don't even like Asta's not even in my fucking probably top ten characters in Black Clover, man. Shit. Mimosa. Uh Cisco Leon. Yeah, Mary Leona, bro. She's she's fucking goat tier. That's my number one. Nero. Nero, whatever the fuck her name is. Yami the goat. Yami the goat, bro. Do I like Zora? Fuck yeah. Even Noel. Even I like Noel. Fuck her family though. Those geese. I wanna slaughter those geese. Fuck that family. Vanessa's just hot. Bacista. <laughs> I like the enemies. I, I I I like I like a lot of things about Black Clover. Julius, I started to like Julius. I started to like Vengeance. Um, who else? Who else is good? Who else is good? Throw fucking names. Noelle is fucking awful. She's one of the worst in the series. <laughs> Seke, bah, bah. Yeah, he's he's funny. He's funny too. Gouch, I have a mixed opinion on Gouch. I don't know. He's funny. I laugh. I laugh with Gouch. Gray is fine. Gray, Gray. Jack is awesome. Jack the Ripper, bro. I fucking love Jack the Ripper. Um, oh my god. Uh, Charlotte, the Blue Rose Captain. Oh god. I hate her sister. Sis, sis. Don't call me sis. That makes me want to fucking grow a cyst. God. Gordon's just peak. Gordon's peak anime. Rivalries ever is beyond me. The villains suck, the transformations look lame, and again, it's just nothing really special. But despite all of that, it's able to have- Wait, I haven't seen this. I haven't seen this. I haven't seen it! Didn't leave that for my guest. Alright, Mask, I think you're being a little too nice to these animes out here. Because most of these series deserve 100% of the hate they get. For yes. example- a Attack on Titan, one of the worst things I've ever experienced in my life. The characters are trash, and the story is even worse. And I'm not just talking about the ending. I'm saying the whole thing's been trash since the beginning. Like the story- <laughs> I'm not just talking about the ending. I'm talking about the beginning to the ending. That's actually funny. That's actually funny. The story starts with a boy seeing his mom get killed by a Titan. Then he becomes an orphan, and now he seeks to get revenge against all Titans because of his mom's death. Yeah, what a fucking idiot. Getting vengeance for his mom's death, being eaten by by, by, by his dad's uh, f f f f first first wife. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Terrible. Like we haven't seen this kind of story a million times before. The protagonist is basically a bootleg Harry Potter. In the series, continues to give you migraines until you get. Bro, I, I, I like whenever I look at Aaron since the second I met him, I said that that that, that that's Daniel Radcliffe. That 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 that, 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 that that's Harry Potter. Always. Always. To the basement stuff. That's the first thing I thought of, bro. That's like you see Armin for the first time, you're like, Willy Wonka. In season four, when it begins to get half decent. But don't worry. Okay, I can't do this. I can't. This is my skin's crawling. Uh, I'm, 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 the fucking chat is cursed again. It's fucking cursed, bro. It's cursed. <laughs> Mm-hmm.